well students in this video we will find the expression of this uh, signal and this signal and their laplace transform so here we can see the signal is a combination of ramp and unit step signal from 0 to 3 it is a ramp signal and from 3 to 5 it is a unit step signal so we will see how to write the expression for ramp and unit step signal. This ramp is starting at t is equals to 0 and ending at t is equals to 3. Or we can say we are seeing one discontinuity here and another at this point. Slope is changing at these two points. So we will write the expression at these points for ramp r t r at t is equals to 0 and ramp at t is equals to 3 okay r t minus 3 and r t minus 0 now we will find the value of slope change at these two points here the slope is 0 now calculate the slope for this ramp slope of ramp signal is del y by del x. The difference in y for this ramp is 3 and difference in x is again 3. So it is equals to 1. Okay. So this is the slope for this ramp. Now calculate the difference of slope initially it was 0 and finally it was 1 it is 1 so the slope change at t is equals to 0 is 1 minus 0 that is equal to 1 so this slope change will come with this term now slope change at this point is initially it is plus 1 and later on it will become 0 don't uh, confuse with, with this unit step signal okay it is zero after this point so finally it is zero and initially it was one at point t is equals to three so the slope change is minus one at this point so write down minus term here so this is the we can remove this one from here now we will write the expression for unit step signal. Unit step signal will be written wherever there is a amplitude change. So for every vertical line we will write a unit step signal. At t is equals to 3 and 5 here there is a vertical line. So u t minus 3 and u t minus 5 instance will come here in the unit step expression. Now amplitude change will also come with this. So here the final amplitude is 1 and initially it was 3. So minus 2 is the amplitude change. So it will become minus 2. In this uh, vertical line or amplitude change the final amplitude is 0 and initially it was 1. So here will come minus 1. So here we can write this minus. Okay. So this is expression Ft for unit step and ramp signal. Now we can easily write the Laplace for these two. Rt is 1 by S square. Rt minus 3 1 by s square e to the power minus 3s because of this time shift minus 2 ut 1 by s e to the power minus 3s again ut minus 1 by s e to the power minus 5s so this is laplace transform as well as expression in ft now we come to our next problem 
this is a curve parabolic type of curve and two curves are given and their equations are given so here in such type of waveforms we have to write the expression the, this expression is already given so first we will write this expression then this expression and then we calculate the slope change and we'll write a ram signal at this point okay so for this type of signal write down this first expression that is 2t square and it is uh, touching uh, this x axis at 0 so write down unit step at t minus 0 another expression that is plus 2 4 minus t whole square u t minus 4 because it's a one point is at t minus 4 another point will be somewhere at the infinity okay at this point they are touching each other so we will calculate the slope change at this point one th one more thing this will be negative because with the increase in time this ft is decreasing so this will be our second term now for the slope change what we will do how to calculate the slope for this first function suppose this first function is 2t square this is our first function we can calculate the slope at each and every point of this curve by differentiating it differentiate this with respect to t it is 4t now put the different values of t and get the slope at t is equals to 0 the slope will become 0 at t is equals to 2 slope will become plus 8 okay so we can get the slope here the slope is 0 and 0 and here at 2 it is plus 8 now similar thing we can do for this curve suppose it is f2 t and the curve is 2 4 minus t whole square differentiate this to get the slope okay this f2 dash is t is nothing but slope of the curve differentiate it with respect to t so it will become 4 4 minus t multiplied with this minus because it is a coefficient so this is f dash t now put t is equals to 2 we will get slope at this point it is equals to slope is minus 8 at t is equals to 4 put t is equals to 4 here it will give you the slope equal to 0 so we calculated slope as minus 8 and 0 here okay there is no slave slope change at this point and this point so we need not to write ram signal but a slope change is we can see here at this point so write down ramp equation that is minus 16 why this minus 16 because slope is finally minus 8 and initially it was plus 8 so it is equals to minus 16 slope change is minus 16 and t is equals to 2 so this is r t minus 2 this is the equation or expression for ft for the given curves now find the laplace transform 2t square write down 2 as it is for t square it is factorial 2 that is 2 divided by s cube ut 1 minus this 2 as it is again this 2 will come as a factorial 2 which is 2 s cube ut minus 4 that is e to the power minus 4s then this ram term minus 16 by 
एस स्क्वायर ई टू दी पावर माइनस टू एस सो दिस इज अवर लैपलास ट्रांसफॉर्म इक्वेशन और एक्सप्रेशन एंड दिस इज अवर एक्सप्रेशन इन टर्म्स ऑफ टी फॉर द गिवेन कर्व्स 